welcome to our YouTube channel. My name is Dawn and this is my other half and partner in crime. Good morning, my name is Dawn. How are we doing? And this is our sales update for the 6th to the 12th of January. Um, so yeah, I've got some... You want to go first with me? Oh, you go first, my dear. Ladies Aww. before gentlemen and all that. Not age before beauty then. <laughs> <laughs> so I've got quite a few sales actually. What did I just say? I've got about eight or something. They're not big money, but they're sales, aren't they? So for a week's work, that's good. So the first one is a, a Mickey Mouse bundle of plushes and other little bits. These were all mine. I've just got no room to put them anywhere, have I? And they were just stuck in a box. So I decided just to put them on auction. I started them at six. I got six fifty better than them being stored in a box, to be honest. And that went with my home, so the postage was four eighty for that. Um, next was this lovely large brown glass storage jar. For um, I've got ten pound for that. Now that came, I think that came out of a clearance that me and you did, a house clearance, and it had like bath salts inside. You probably can't remember the rest of that. Was that yesterday? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and um, yeah, I was really pleased to get ten pound for that. I had that up for fifteen for quite a long time actually. Um, and I accepted a £10 offer on it. I thought, yeah, get done, get rid, get done. These are what Dave bought me, which are retro dessert dishes. Oh, no, not these ones. In a minute, there will be. These are retro dessert dishes times six. I got £6 for these. Again, this came in that huge glass bundle that I bought on the live auction for three quid. And I'm still selling stuff out of that lot. I think I've sold... No, I've still got stuff out of that box still up for sale, so I'm really pleased with that. Uh, this one is the Stella... What? What is that? What? Atros? It's that beer. You'll see them in the picture. Um, embossed, I put point chalice glass times six, and I got £12 for that. Now, you'll probably see this in my one of our videos, but I did a you know, cell similar, and of course I thought they were pint glasses because the picture on the cell similar that the person had sold them for was exactly the same glass as mine. So of course I just thought, right, all right, I use all that, it's the same thing, put my own pictures on, they're not pint glasses, are they? Um, so I've had the person contact me at the beginning of the week, wasn't it? Today's now Friday, I think it contacted me Monday. No, before that, wasn't it? I don't know that. I think it was Sunday, Saturday or Sunday, to say to me that they are not the pint glasses that they're meant to be. And I went, all right then. Um, send it back to me. There's a return label on there. He wanted my address, even though the return label's on the actual parcel, so you can return it to us. Um, and then in the next question, he said, well, where's my pint glasses? Are you sending them here? <coughs> and I had to explain, well, obviously that's the wrong, wrong thing for me to be writing. I haven't had them back. I'm meant to be refunding their £12, but I haven't had nothing back yet. So I don't know what to do about it, so I'm just leaving it. It's in their ball court, not mine. So, I don't know. I don't know what to do on that one. Next is my favourite. The last and final champagne flutes for £10 <laughs> from Italy. Um, they came out of that live auction and the glass uh, bundle for three quid and I got ten pounds for them and they were from Italy. I love them. How many right? lots of flutes have you sold? Four. Four so for forty four, quid. Yeah, four for forty quid. So that For three pounds. Yeah. And then all the other glass on top that I've also sold from that lot as well. Another box full of glasses which were twelve pounds and then I've got them dishes. They were um another eight pound and then another one six pounds. So I've made quite a lot of money on mm. that three pound so i'm really pleased with that um a pair of vintage dark cream curtains i absolutely love selling curtains they're so quick and easy to photograph just say about the stains if any cleaning etc i usually and um, these ones i paid a pound and i've got 13 pound 50 for them so i'm really pleased i will start the, them as an auction um <coughs> then next is a vintage retro six raven head box glasses this is what dave bought from the john sale for me for 50p which ones are them, my dear? Them ones that you said you used to have them when you was little. Oh, yeah, they're yeah, They're very yeah. fragile glasses. And I had lovely feedback from them as well. They're very pleased with them. I've got £6 for them. They got me a two-year-old. Yeah, Jesus yeah. Christ. Um, and last but least is a vintage lipstick, Elizabeth Erden. 
for £10 um, and I've got free potion and packaging and I think that lipstick came out from a, a load of um, stuff from them so I wouldn't have paid that much money for it and it was brand new and I think it's about like 20 years old or something but people <laughs> like vintage vintage makeup so I've got £10 and free potion and even and I gave them free postage for that, so it still made six pound, just under six pound with all the fees in it. You're doing well. So yeah. Doing better than me. <laughs> Aww, mind you, this week's been a good week for us. So, well, yeah, you've had a few things this week. Not many, my dear. Oh, that was me. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so now it's over to Dave. <laughs> well, I didn't think it'd take long. I've only got four, but um, I told them. Mobile phones, um, got these at the auction, we bought them all together for a pound, I sold the others last time I think, so these were like yeah. 50p, got six quid for them, so that weren't too bad. Now, Hyrex Cups and Saucers, Blue Irish, 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 oh, Irish flower, Irish flower, Pyrex Six Cups and Saucers, this was part of a job lot I bought, wasn't it? Yeah. For four quid. I was originally going to sell these all together. I was going to sell it as a big bundle. But a lady on here called Kath, who watches us, she suggested we split them. And I've got, um, was it £47 for the lot? Mm -hmm. I'd only put them on for £25, wouldn't I, all together. So £47 out of £4. Thank you very much indeed. I've got £10 for these cups and saucers, by the way. So, I'm very chuffed with that one. This next one is a vice. I, I can remember saying about this the other day, can I? Probably when we do, like, when we do something, oh, yeah. we always mention about things that we start. Well, basically, we was at the auction the other week. It's pouring down the rain, wasn't it? Yeah. I bid, bid a toolbox up to, to three quid. <coughs> I don't mind splashing out a bit, you know. <laughs> and, um,. <coughs> He said to me, do you want the next box? There was another tool box. Oh, this would be on the video that we uploaded the other day about the shed and you was talking about it. Oh, yeah, that's right. So you this is like word for word. So you've heard so all this So if you're before. new, that's... Well, this is, uh, you wouldn't know yeah, about so it. If you're old, you would know about this. <laughs> I said to me, do you want both? Do you want both lots? I said, well, how much are you going to read? He said, hang on, I'll work it out. He said, a pound. I said, what? You mean a pound? Like, pound for both lots? He said... Yeah, go on. So I give them a pound for tool. They know you so well in that place. So, and this was in one of the boxes, and I got fifteen quid for that. So <coughs> we're we're money up on that already. And there's loads of bits and bobs. So um, I have got two frying pans. Been on there for a, ever and a, a day. I think Noah had these for a little while. <laughs> um, I got eight. I just put them down to eight pound. Just to try and get rid of them. <coughs> That was the 11th. That's the last one then, Dawn. That's the 14th, that next one. Yeah, so, mind so you, that's all I, got. We have, I mean, this is old stock we're selling because we both generally have been very unwell at the moment. Yeah, I've not been very well at Yeah, all so I have been putting little bits on out eBay, but at the moment we've been extremely unwell, so um, we're only, well, I'm slowly getting over it, but this is two weeks in now I've had mine, and you're Nearly a week now, aren't you? Whenever you got yours. Yeah, my old chest. I got a good chest of I've had no. some, some silly jobs in me last So time. to have any sales now, considering we've not been putting anything on, has been really good, I think, personally. Because it's old stock and we need to get rid mm. of the old stock anyway. But I mean, I am... He's doing today. I'm doing. I'm he's, doing the doing. He's doing these fantastic. You would have seen this in the shed clearance. He's cleaning these up. Um, they're not a whole set. But you can still get money for them. Oh, God, yeah. Because I think people could use them for their doors or whatever. People like just buying one on their people own. People like numbers and that. Don't, watch, don't put that over there, Don. I've got, I've got a system, you know. Oh, blimey, God. See so what for that with? <laughs> <laughs> and, so, yeah. Uh, yeah, they It's a really big old thing, isn't it? They all have a number. A oh, yeah, number. he has them on there. He always buys them up on yeah. the show, doesn't he? You and see what we watch, bit, don't you? A little bit of wax on there. God knows why, but this is his favourite wax, so he gets this from Screwfix. Screwfix. It's about uh, ten pounds. Well, sort of ten pounds. I'll, I'll get three, 
free got things, vouchers, don't I? Yeah. yeah. We got voucher for a ten, so you only have to pay a pound. Oh, it's not exactly my favourite, because <laughs> my favourite is I get them when we used to do the health clearances, didn't I? Yeah. But that's your favourite. Yeah, well, by I got far, a token so the other week, so I thought, oh, I'll get a need something of that. for cleaning. This is great stuff. Dave would highly recommend this. Cause it, and it smells really nice, actually. Yeah, that's the big thing when I open the box. It smells nice. <laughs> it's sad that and you like And the fact put a bit of wax on them sort of makes it... Um, made an effort, isn't it? Yeah, made an effort. That's, that's what I think, anyway. So, yeah, that's our sales update for the week. I did promise we'll put it up this week. <coughs> we was hoping an iron if to not put it up or not. Um, but we did. We decided yes. I bullied her into it. They never. I bullied. <laughs> <laughs> We've got sales going out today. I've got two. You've got one. Our son's got one. He's still blooming well. We're going to have to be careful. He's going to take over. Yeah, we're going to invest in our son. I think. <laughs> we're going to get him to do our new pays because he's selling every week. He's saying to us he sold something. He's doing all right, bless him. Yeah, he's really into it as well, which we're really proud of him. But anyway, um, so yeah, that's the sales update for the week. Don't forget to like, subscribe and notification. hit that notification button to be notified of our videos. Thank you for all the fantastic likes. The subscribers keeps going up and up, which I love seeing. We do indeed. Thank you for watching us. Yeah, that's the main thing. Because we love doing these videos. We always say that every time we do these videos. We love doing these. We enjoy it thoroughly. Um, and thank you for the support of the video I just put up. Yes, this morning actually, which is my charity shop. I do apologise if I keep winking like this, but the sun's right in my eyes. Um, the charity shop one wasn't very good footage, but it was I good could footage. Show you hey, they can see me. <laughs> <laughs> that's me, Matt, the impersonation. <laughs> right then, so that's it then. Um, what is it? We might be going to an auction tomorrow, depending on weather in it, and if you could stand out in the cold. No, no, we're not worried about it's the wet. We don't want to be standing in we the wet. We don't want to be. Now. We don't need we, to be standing um, in the wet. <coughs> if the weather's fine tomorrow, we'll be taking you guys with us to an outside auction at Swatham. We're taking our son and his girlfriend as well, so I think it's her first time being in an auction. Yeah. So well, she's quite excited. We used to go there years ago, didn't we? Yeah. Why are you whispering, Dawn? I don't know. It's <laughs> like a secret squirrel. Don't tell yeah. No, don't tell me while we're going. <laughs> but um, we haven't been there for. Oh, Ten years? Yeah, yeah. It'd be interesting if we get... Um, it's a good old auction, but you've got to sort of look at the stuff <laughs> properly. There's a lot of old... Um, no, there's old house clearance people are like, aren't they? Yeah. Well, we used to be one ourselves, so we know what it's like. There is a lot of old broken crap, but you can... You but can sort yourself some good stuff out I was going to say, because we buy, like... That's what I was saying about these charity shops. Um, because we go to these auctions, we get well spoiled... So then, when you go in the charity shops, it's like, oh, I can, nah, I, I could get a nice big bundle of stuff yeah. for three quid we don't really and do make my money. Shops, so, no, not really. No, the only thing I would start buying at the charity shops is either clothes and curtains, but at the moment I'm not doing clothes. So you wouldn't buy them then? No. But I used to. Clothes but for us now. So I, I would buy, I wouldn't buy clothes out of there, but I would buy clothes out of there. You can't, isn't it? Like, you know what I mean? <laughs> Sure. You can tell he's getting better because he's insulting <laughs> me now. <laughs> I feel like I'm crabbing on you. It's not your fault. You've been really ill. You can st you can hear it's still on us. When we, we done the, the uh, <coughs> when we done the shed the other day, I was like, <laughs> it was so miserable. <laughs> <laughs> and he watches himself and goes, "Oh, don't look very happy, do I?" <laughs> you mean all looking sod? <laughs> Can I just say he's like that advert on the telly with that footballer where he's listening to the podcast and then he goes, "I'm so funny." That's you. He does that when he when you guys are not being recorded video. That's what he does. He watches the back going, "I'm so funny." <laughs> I love that. I always say when I see it, "That's you, Dave." <laughs> Right, we're going to let those lovely people go. Yeah, we're going to see... Oh, don't forget to follow us on Instagram. Our Instagrams are going off as well. Mine is, anyway, so I'm getting a few people. So... Thanks for keep watching us. <laughs> we do appreciate it. And we'll see you later with another video very soon. Bye! Bye!